This is the first discussion about finding your center, the first step in mental toughness. When you hit and you're calm, you play very well. You're not over aroused or you're not under aroused. Your mind is clear. You read all the mental toughness books by Jim Lair and Grapple and ISO. You read it from Leech. You talk to Gould and even um, Braden, Boletari. They, all, this, all the coaches say the same thing. Don't think, just play. But how do you find a center? Some of my students like to sing a song to themselves. Um, the biggest key is repetition. You're so confident in your abilities that you don't think. You just do it. It's like walking. Do you tell yourself how to walk? No, you just walk. You don't tell yourself, lift your right foot, lift your left foot, move your knee. No, you just walk. Same thing in tennis. You don't want to be saying, get the racket back. Oh, my God. Swing through the ball. Make contact in front. No, you want to just hit the ball. Okay. Now, the arousal factor is big. If you're under aroused and you don't care, you're flat, then you have to pick yourself up. You move your feet. You breathe faster. Take shorter breaths. Get the blood going. You'll, you'll actually feel your heart rate go up. If you're over aroused and your heart rate going too quickly, you do the opposite. You take deep breaths. You slow down. Um, I make my kids count to eight and take a deep breath. Or I make, make them spell something. I used to make them spell concentrate. Uh, C, deep breath. O, deep breath. And by the time you get to the end, you're, you're very focused. And then we'll talk about mantras later. But you also need to find your center where it is. My center is a place where I'm slightly up, upset, but I'm not overly upset. Too upset, and I play poorly. Everyone's center is different. So once you find your center, you know how you have to play. Playing a match, you feel like you're playing in, this, playing in the park with your old student. Very calm, very cool, no pressure, and you're carefree, and you're just having a good time. Generally speaking, when you have fun, you're going to win. And if you're having a miserable time, you're generally going to lose. Tennis is just a game after all, and games are supposed to be fun.